All right, we got another episode going. So last time we did a bunch of activities. Ooh, explosions. Uh, no. For the most part, got quite a bit done the past two episodes. It was filling in the activities of the Middle Island because we're, we're taking that from the Morning Stars. Um, the last fourth spot, well, three spots are gang operations. So we need our vehicle to find them. I'll run with you. And that's because I want to just drive around until I find the fuckers. Do you mind, bro? We gotta go. We got. The, we gotta drive around until we can find those gang operations. I'm gonna put like right in there. Gotta find it. Mm. Bam, 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 bam. GPS shortcut. Again, it, it's only four goddamn gang operation, operations. That's why I'm like, where are they? Oh, shit. Maybe they don't show up for a bit? I don't know. Yeah, we'll, we'll call Pierce and do a mission then. That was too close. If we're gonna get a cash flow going, we'll need a business to funnel us money. You wanna rob some store? That'll cause more problems than it's worth. I'm saying we buy one from the Morning Star. Yeah, because they'll jump at the chance to sell to us. Nope, because we already have the deed. Come again? We take the deed from the lockbox and purchase the store in our name instead. Well, if they can't argue. Sure, why not? So, friendly fire? Yep. Best thing is, owning it gives us a discount. Nice. Find the sex doll? What? Okay, now I'm just confused. Like, what the fuck? How is this tied to the mission? Oh, that's a nice car. Okay, but really, this probably could have been done if we just drove over here. It's whatever, though. We're, we're here. It's fine. No. No hitting anything. Pierce, what, what the hell is this? Oh, that? A little hobby of mine. Uh, okay, I'm out of here. Shit, I don't mean it like that. They're collectible. You're supposed to try and find them all. People collect some weird shit. <sighs> Let's get out of here. I have the need to shoot something now. I've seen Morningstar all over the city doing deals and shit. Sounds perfect. We wipe them off a corner, they'll think twice about coming back. What other deeds were in that box? An apartment building. Didn't I already get us a new place? <laughs> Brick and mortar, baby. Real estate is cheap. Huh. Take more money out of the syndicate's pocket and into ours. I like it. Stay down! Stop that, Pierce. Pierce, stop with the pew pews. Sit down, Pierce. Yeah. So 
here's one of the operations we couldn't find. I don't have any grenades, that's dumb. And the final one. Really? Just just gonna stand there, boy? Good times. Know anywhere else they do business? Yeah, up to the north. Trying to get through. These vehicles are not conducive of a good uh, escape. I'm a professional. Thank you. Take him out, take him out, take him out. Come on, come on. Get, come on, get wrecked, get wrecked. You think? Friendly fire. That should get them to back off. Why would a gun store get them to back off? Because we own it. So we got boys protecting it. Any place the Saints own should be able to take the heat off you. Good to know. Very good to know, even though we've been doing this for a while. Definitely got to hold on to that fucking, uh... Hold the wheel, hold the wheel. Struggling to keep this thing straight. Come on. Ooh, that was a close call. So many close calls. Gonna be impressed if we can make it. If we can make it. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Get out. Okay. Now what? That was the mission? Oh, okay. Cool.
I love that the mission has given us less money than the activities we've been doing. Whatever, though. Um, seventy one. Did not realize we could upgrade the, the uh, grenades. Again, you can you can tell I've not played this game in years. I'm just like, wait, you can upgrade this? Nah, I don't need that one. Um, upgrade you. Access crib weapons. Just gonna go fisticuffs. No, actually, no, no. I guess. some more cash all right so the, all that's left is those three things which are both gang operations so i'm gonna see if with the do missions for that go to the broken shillelagh i'm surprised the syndicate is still standing after all this shit we've thrown at them i don't see a reason to stop not saying we should all right they see you at the broken shillelagh Finally got a bike. Is there a vehicle place we can hit up first? There is a garage. We're going to hit that up. That's a tattoo shop, I just realized. We will go to the Broken Shillelagh. I'm just going to get to a garage first. We got two cars, I might as well get a fucking bike too. Surprisingly, I'm better with bikes than I am cars. I think it's the less space I take up. That and I just like bikes more. Can I customize the bike? I hate how slow turning this is. Oh, it's because I'm in a mission. Hold on, that's what it is. That was it. Okay. I'm over here like, what the fuck? That was it. I like that one. That one. That one. Seats. That one. Purple as we do. Go with the silver.
metal is gonna be that. Window tint's gonna be black. Isn't it? Well. We'll grab Nas, like we're gonna use it, but we'll, we'll get some. Head to the broken shillelaghs. I'm surprised the syndicate is still standing after all this shit we've thrown at him. I don't see a reason to stop. Not saying we should. All right, they'll see you at the broken shillelagh. I forget, isn't a shillelagh a, um, like a walking stick for the Irish? Like, I feel like that's what it is. I could be very wrong. It just, it, I feel like that's what it is. I don't remember. It's a, it is a walking stick. Okay. Doesn't seem like your kind of place, Pierce. What's the hate? The beer is cheap, and I'm the best looking motherfucker in here. Look, you may think it's time to kick back, but I'm done toying with these bastards. I want Loren, and I want him now. So where is he? No idea. But 10K says he's hiding out in that big ass skyscraper. Uh, Loren's a tactician. He's not gonna hole up in a building that screams, I'm a criminal mastermind. I need something concrete. To hit up powder. No, uh, I don't have time for a stripper. No, Powder's a designer gun store downtown. I saw some of Loren's thugs talking to the owner. There's got to be something there. All right, let's go shopping. <coughs> am I going with Pierce or am I going by myself? How could you do that? Guess I'm going. Myself? Oh, hit the powder room. Okay. Shandy, give me good news. We're gonna burn powder to the ground. That's a little extreme. See you there. Shandy, wait. Oh boy. <laughs> Even he's just like, whoa, I'm the mad one, but like. What? I love this like narrative that is the main character, I mean the player character is meant to be like this angry ass fucking gang leader, but in this game Shandi's like, "No, no, no, no. You're not angry enough." Leaving him to be like, "Oh no. What what what, what have we done?" <laughs> Shondi, whatever you're planning, can we not do it? A lot of people with guns in there. We'll go in the back way. You don't think the back's guarded? There's like two punks. What about the inside, motherfucker? Put in your tampons and let's do this. She spoke, let's go. I'm not getting in her way, how's that? For the record, Shandi, you lost to the best. your fault. Probably could have been done so much easier if you just didn't open fire. Great plan, Shandi. You said two guys, not my fault. No, I'm serious. This is my kind of plan. Okay, let's get inside. Let's get inside. They have snipers in here. Yeah, well, guess what? So do we. Whoever's in charge here probably knows where to find Loren. Let's head to the office and see if they're hiding under their desk. Ooh, I 
keeps the blood pumping to my loins. Oh! You ain't lost a step! You ain't nothing but a hound dog. Keep moving, keep moving up, keep up. Nope, not that way. You gotta go this way. Moving through here. Do not do this the wrong way, Shondi. Oh, shit. Oh, this can't be good. Minigun! Just saying this is all Shondi's fault. You bet your ass I'm taking the minigun. Anyone else? Come on, I know there's one more of you. Okay then. Moving up, moving up, moving up. Come on. I do not think it is actually this easy to run with a minigun. Like, if I remember right, it is very damn near hard to run with a minigun. Let alone just hold one. Come on, where's the corner? Taking everyone down. Gonna rinse, rinsing these catwalks down because apparently there's a fucking janitorial problem here. It's full of pests. Looks like they don't want us. You want ants? This is how you get it. Nope, nope, nope. Such a fucking power move. Yeah, you guys just keep covering me because the manager cleared out. I'll get what I can off the computer. By all means, Shandy. Me and Pierce got your back. You lost to the best. Did we get it, Shondi? You good? Yeah, we did. Between the minigun and the sniping thing, that was actually really fun. Wait. Still, okay, so we still got that, those three areas. Ooh, so close to 100 grand. Pierce, we've waited long enough. Now we go for Loren. It won't be easy. That whole tower's gotta be crawling with Morningstar. Since when have we done things the easy way? True. 
So what's the plan? Kill everyone we see and find Loren? Makes sense. Meet me at the penthouse. I'll call Shandi. Shandi, it's time. Just tell me where to be. We're meeting at the penthouse. I am gonna kill that son of a bitch. Don't worry. He won't get away this time. You bet your ass he won't. I have the feeling, and correct me if I'm wrong, she may be mad. I'm just thinking, she, she might be a bit mad at all of this. I could have died. And while she is totally justified in that anger, I don't know if it's good. I don't actually remember from between two and three if Shandi and Gat are together. I forget if it's they were together or if they were just really good friends leading to this reaction. Because if it's a good friend thing, I would, I would appreciate it more. If only just because we need more fiction where it's a platonic sense of revenge, not always a romantic one. Nothing wrong with romantic senses of revenge. But platonic people, I mean, people in platonic relationships can go fully off the handle like this, too. Like, it is not unheard of, of someone being like, no, you fucked up my best friend, I am doing, it doesn't have to be a lover. Arguably, it shouldn't be a lover because, well, then you're tarnishing the, the lover's uh, vibe. Let us go do the Belgian problem. That was close. <laughs> Sorry, Get lady. The fuck out of here. Sorry, ladies. Hey, okay, where are we? We're driving on the edge of this fucking box. I really don't know what the fuck it is, so we'll just we'll we'll get it eventually. Maybe the maybe it goes away when we beat Loren. Whoa, almost. I don't honestly remember, because it's again years since I played this game. It could legitimately be that I just need to beat Loren himself. Okay, let's do this. Uh, that's a little big for you. Give me the goddamn gun, Pierce. Okay. All right, let's give that motherfucker what's coming to him. Yeah. Dramatic slow walk. So she's going with what I'm assuming is like an M60. With a grenade launcher attached. Does an M60 have a grenade launcher attachment? Are you sure you want to do this, Shandi? Don't worry about me. I need this. Loren has to pay for what he did, and I want to be there when he gets what he deserves. No worries, girl. Oh, Let's shit, it does. Loren. We're taking out his whole fucking syndicate. I think we'll need to do a little more than kill one guy to do that. You can steal that bomb for nothing. Like to be fair, like, that. you can de destroy oh, an entire city. fine if Philippe will be. Come on, he's a criminal mastermind. He's got to be on the top floor. It's like a rule. You think he's going to be that cliche? Doesn't matter. We're killing everyone in there. I, for one, love the, the player Should character being, the like, right very trope-savvy. It's all taken care of. As soon as we make sure the loading dock is clear, they'll drive it in. It is one of my favorite tropes of this character, that he is so tr um, pop media savvy. That it's just like, no, we're gonna, it's going to happen like this. Go check that gun? How long is it going to take us to get there? I was just asking. Save it for Lorenz goons. Yeah, no, like, having a player character that's very aware of, like, the, the tropes that he is existing in, so funny. It's not breaking the fourth wall, but it's definitely like, no, guys, we're in a fucking, like, this scenario. It's gotta go like this. You're joking. I need a new vehicle, because that one ain't going nowhere. 
Um, you'll do. You really don't want to ride with me. You'll do. Murder time, fun time. I'm not doing Professor Genki, but I'm down for that. Showing up in a nondescript car probably is for our, our betterment anyway. Please don't mind me. Uh, sneak in there. Everybody bail. Let's go. Johnny teach you that? They ain't fucking around here. Fuck him up. City. Come on. Sniper down, sniper down. Moving up, moving up. Shit, they have snipers in here. You think all packages are this hard to drop off here? Ha ha, can you just shoot them? You guys gonna help me, or are you just gonna like me do this my whole all my, myself? I put you down. What the fuck? Oh, I got with one shot. Damn, nice. Oh! Nope. Nope. That was close. Thank you for whichever one of you took that one down. It's good, good, good. Move. Here it comes. I think it's so fucking big. Bomb setting the clock's ticking. Why didn't we wait to do that until after we killed the run? That's a really good question. We should move. You think? Let's do this. We should have. What did you do? It wasn't me. It just stopped. Guys, he's aware of our plan. I do believe- what the fuck did we walk in on- oh yeah, it's this fucking creepy ass sci-fi lab. Forgot about that. Excuse me. No. Damn it, she moved. Let's go, let's go, let's go. How'd I get pinned? What the fuck is this room? Are those people in there? Looks like all those big guys we keep seeing. Clones? Makes sense to me. What? Uh, okay, maybe make sense was too strong. <laughs> Call him. John! You ain't getting out of this works, are you? 
I'm loving this. Just their whole their whole just their whole debate on what to call these guys is perfect. Because you gotta admit, when you're in a situation situation like this, yeah, no one else has a name for them. What are you gonna call them? Who's gonna correct you? It is literally just a hey. We got the gobbledygooks here. Let's uh, you know, gobbledy them or whatever. I don't know. Hell, I don't even know if that's actually a good way to describe them. Probably isn't. What the hell is all this? Science! And nudity. Nobody look. Philip likes his things custom made. And for his brutes, I am the master pattern, you see. Why are you still strung up if they already cloned your ass? The copies are flawed. They have my brawn, but not my brain. I can help you. The last time a big naked dude said he could help me, it did not end well. What could he do anyway? Those wires and shit are probably keeping him alive. Trust me, I'm still strong enough to kill Philippe. I'm down. I am definitely down to have the giant naked Russian dude helping us out. Though I would prefer if he wore pants. You want some clothes, man? No time. He has a point. We are on the clock. Man, like I said, last time a big naked dude. Here's. Let it go. This elevator will take us to the offices. Then let's take the elevator. Follow me to Philip's office. Seriously, man, you know, if you want, I can find you like a curtain or something for you, you know? The human body is nothing to be ashamed of, unless you have insecurities. I'm good. Hey, man, you got a name? My name is Oli Kirloff. So, what did you do before you were a glorified pincushion? I think it's best for our friendship I never elaborate. Just know that the enemy of your enemy is your friend. As long as you oppose the Syndicate, you have nothing to fear from me. Works for me. Welcome to the Saints. Right? Lorenzo's office is this way. Again, just the, just the idea of the naked dude charging you like that. Okay, that was actually kind of badass. The way he just, like, lightly tilts his head. There's no way to catch you. Fuck that. What are we doing? Oh, we're doing this. Okay. Knock this thing loose. I'm gonna crush that son of a bitch. Leave it to me. I've got this one. Hurry it up. He's getting away. He's getting away. I am the, uh, sitting duck. Someone knock my thing down. He's Belgian, not French. Oh boy, th th this should have killed. Oh shit. No. That's what she said? I feel like that's, that's what she said, joke. Oh no, are we gonna... We got him, boys. Damn it. Um, Belgian pancake joke. Time to blow this place to hell. Okay, this place more than respect anything, but it would or cash. To destroy Philip's research without seeing what we can harvest from it. We came here to send a message, didn't we? Why not keep the building for yourself? Your choice here, boss. Uh, cash or respect? Oh, like... Hold on. What, did I go with one the last time? I don't even remember. Hold on. I'm checking my achievements. Did I get both? If I didn't get both, I'll go with the other one. Thankfully, I'm in this, so the, t the timer's not ticking down. Okay, let's see. What do we got? Uh, 
did I get them both? Because if I got them both, then I don't care. Uh, do, 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 do. I think we got them both. Hmm. Yeah, I think so. I think we got both. Madokin. Mm, kaboom. Um. Uh, do my own stunts, stick the landing, uh, storm in the yarn, get off my back, toward the farce. When you've, like, done, uh, 70, like, three quarters of the achievements already, it's like, wait, which one did I not do? Fuck it. I don't care. We're gonna go with... The cash. I mean, the respect. I don't need the cash. Besides, sh this is about Shandi getting her message. Well, let's give Shandi that. That's one ugly ass building. It's time we went back home and buried Johnny. The amount of damage the city that would have caused. Just say. Remote RC present. Ooh. We got Oleg. 10% all respect earned for destroying the Morning Stars. I would say that was a good choice. When I left Stillwater for the Senate, I vowed never to forget my hometown roots. My husband gave his life defending Stillwater from gang violence. It is my greatest privilege to honor that man's him in a with suit. this bridge. Back the... The luchadors. Oh, we almost hit the senator. Who are these guys? Are they called the Luchadors? I forget. Oh, bye bye. That's gonna jack up our premiums. Kill the time for the high spot, boys. It's always a rocket launcher. Every game is better with one wall that's more than one rocket launcher. I forgot about that. Oh, we are fucked. Well, just ruin two of your own guys' vehicles. Way to go. I guess they're kind of expendable. Pierce, Pierce. Oh, we got lucky. Snipe it, snipe it, snipe it, snipe it. Oh my fuck. Well. Whoever this crew is, they flow pretty damn good. They'll kill Ben's thugs. Kill who? He's the syndicate's attack dog. What he did to Johnny's funeral. That's over the fucking limit. He doesn't care about the rules of engagement. No, apparently no rules. not. I can work with that. You're not ready to fight the Syndicate. Watch us. Just relax, Shandi. All right, big man, what do you got? There are others who hate the Syndicate as much as you do. I will take you to them. I like that. Can you believe this? On my husband's bridge! <laughs> no, 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 I will not come down. I am heading back to the hill. Book an emergency session. God damn it, this is war.
Oh no, not that. All right, who's first? Picking up a. Okay, we're gonna. This we, we are. Wait, uh, missing checkpoint was not saved. What? We're in a mission. Girl named Kenzie Kensington. Oh, the oh, and I'm holding mind. her on a barge on the river. I know which What's one. What's her doing. deal? Oleg said she was with the FBI. The fuck you say? I do like Kenzie. She's like one of my favorites. Muscles. Revive speed should be better. Yes. Uh, Decker's Morning Star. Oh, it is the Luchadors. Okay. Um, sprint increase. Yes. We have the money now, so I don't mind spending on it. Um, yeah, fuck it. Don't have to worry about the Deckers at all. Um, give me the explosion reduction, because you saw what happened there. Combat, grenades, pistols. These are all ammo, and that's going to build up. Faster reloads? Yes. Um, okay, for now, that's good. That's good. Five timer. Um, change back up. Eh, fuck it. Yeah, why not? Bonuses? No. No. Stronghold? Okay. Don't stress. She was kicked out. So we're getting a shitty fat. Oh, don't start hating because we're getting a new girl. Are you serious? I'm not <laughs> saying. I'm just saying. I'm not jealous. Who said jealous? That's all on you, girl? Oh my god. Flirt later. Why was Kinsey booted? Oleg didn't give me all the details, but he made it sound like Kinsey was about to out the syndicate so the Decker set her up for a fall. Ugh. I hope she's worth the hassle. Only one way to find out. You gotta get on that barge. The short answer is yes, Kinsey is worth the fucking hassle. Definitely fucking worth the hassle. You ask me. Again, I love that the player character is a fucking nerd. It just adds a layer of awesome to his character. Sorry, but no. That's right. Move up. The swords are hilarious to me. Like, I know why they have them, but it's still never not funny. These neo um, cyberpunk nerds are just like, ooh. That being said, their stores, clothing wise, have some of the best outfits, so I'm happy that we get to fight them next. Good. 
the blood pumping to my, my loins. loins. Oh. Nice one, boss. Very good. Very goddamn good. Let's move on up and find ourselves. Kenzie Kensington? Yep. You don't seem that excited about being rescued. I'm waiting to see if you were sent to kill me. Girl's pragmatic. I like her. Yeah, come, come on, kid. Wakey, wakey. So what do you want with me? You don't look like the feds. We heard that you know some people who hate the syndicate as much as we do. We hate the f syndicate. You hate the syndicate. Let's make well, some friends. the DeWinters are keeping Zemos at safe word. What? The DeWinters are the twin sisters that run prostitution in Steelport. Zemos was their competition, so the sisters locked him up. And Safe Word is just a BDSM club that caters to various acts of perversion. The name comes from Holt. Ah, we got it. Mine's Teacup. I'll get her out of here. <laughs> Have fun at the Gimp Show. All right. Oh, so we got. We still got to finish it. Okay. Got to go to that BDSM club, kids. You and this Zemo guy makes two. Usually I get three people to help me. I think I know someone who'd help, but I gotta find him first. I'll call you when I have a location. This is gonna be one of those weird levels where you got to just roll with it, guys, and just if you don't know what's gonna happen. You ever been to one of these clubs? I look like I go to one of those clubs. I was just saying, you know, powerful guy, stressful job. Stop talking. That's <laughs> what I thought. Shut up. <laughs> anyway, no, like this is one of those missions that you gotta accept that where we're going is gonna be weird. And you just gotta roll with it, cause you know it, it's it, it's just what it is. And by weird, I don't mean because we're going to a BDSM club. Weird, as in just how it's gonna unfold. The more I play it, the more I think that Saints Row is definitely um, modern a mo modern alternate reality version of D and D in that like a lot of the missions are played straight but damn do they fall apart and become DD &D missions so quickly and you don't even have time to like realize until it's like oh god this is how we did the mission like look how we beat loren that was definitely a DD &D mission gone wrong here we go we can just walk in the door we what are we doing here how the hell are we supposed to find this guy? Shake people down? Someone's got to know where they're keeping our boy. You know what? Fuck it. Let's let's just make this the thing. When it when in this place, let's you know. Zemos says, or I'm gonna beat you stupid. Oh, oh, yes! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. The manager's upstairs. He ain't no. Just take me. Oh, I've been bad. Again, it's it's gonna get weirder before it gets not weird. Just roll with it and accept what we accept what happens. You the manager? I don't know anything. I'm just here for a bachelor party. Ugh. Not what you I meant to do. Step. Definitely not what I meant to do. All right, come on. Oh, is the manager here? Nice try. Come here, talk. Where's Zemos? Well, if I say anything, the DeWinter sisters will cut me off. If you don't say anything, something else is getting cut off. He's in the pony barn. All right. Come on then. Show us to this. Just like old times. You are going to take us to this pony barn. There we go. Right, right. Oh, I'm impressed. 
That was actually a good shot. What the? Not a fan of the whole, like, they're coming behind us thing. No one else? Good. Keep going, keep going. Not that way. That way. Were we supposed to go through that door that those people were coming out of? I guess we were. Shit. If I never see this place again... It'll be too soon. Ugh. Remind me to get some hand sanitizer after this. Don't right. worry. We'll get a box of that shit. <laughs> that being said, it is good to be uh, safe and clean. How are we going to find Zemos? Look for the cat in here who isn't excited to be eating a ball gag? Or just look for the guy with the rhinestone Z on his back. Fuck out of here, man. Oh, well, shit. That's convenient. <laughs> they went this way. Oh, shit. <laughs> we don't got time, Zemos. Mush! Just keep going, Zemos. Yeah, that's not how that's supposed to work. Like I said, this is where it gets weird and you just need to accept it as like, hey, D and D. But with not D and D stuff. Sorry about making you you know, pull us around. This is a rescue, right? <laughs> this ain't some elaborate setup for a gang bang. Why you gotta put that image in my head, bro? Oh, I'll go with rescue then. <laughs> I would shake your hands, but them floors were a little sticky, if you know what I'm saying. Thanks for not shaking our hands. I'm good. Find a moist towelette or something. Hey, what's up? I found the guy I was talking about. His name's Angel de la Muerte. He was Kilbane's tag team partner until he went crazy. Well, until Angel went crazy or Kilbane went crazy? I should probably look into that. The point <laughs> is, Angel hates Kilbane more than you do. He should be willing to help. Where do I find him? That's the tricky part. The luchadors are attacking him at the gym right now. You should probably hurry before he gets killed. Why didn't you start with that? You ask too many questions. I hurry up, you're on the clock. <sighs> okay. S Hey, Kenzie, where the fuck is he? Thanks, player. I appreciate you busting me out. Don't mention it. Like, like ever. Ever. Again, I love. Come on, Z. We got a rescue to mount. Don't say mount. I, I take it saddle up is out too? If you didn't just bust me out, I'd be walking the other way. I love Zemos for his, like, unique communication method. It's especially after having just watched Hasman Hotel. I love this. It's giving major Alistair vibes, and I'm loving it. Thankfully, we don't have a clock ticking, because, damn, I, I'm trying to find my way. That sounded like Sasuke. I wonder if that was the guy who voices Sasuke from Naruto. Just the way he yelled, come face me, I'm like, wait a minute. Zemos, let's not piss off the locals. We gotta get to see Angel before you can do it. Oh, we're in the military zone, shit. I just realized that's why. Cause I'm like, wow, these are a lot of Humvees, shit. Yeah, it's cause we're in the military's corner, shit, fuck. Bail, bail. It's 
fine. It's fine. It's fine. Get back in the car, Z. That was awkward. Zemos, get in the. I was gonna say get in the saddle, but I'm like, wait. That'll show him. Oh, fuck. That was close. Fuck. Whoa. Whoa. We don't have a rear bumper. Fuck. How does that take you back, bro? What the hell did you do? I don't want to know what you did. Oh, shit. Shit. What the hell is that thing? Not who I wanted to go for. Shit. My guy, my guy, come on. Don't fuck with the saints. Ow. Put me down, big man. May not be comfortable, but nice you Oleg, nice of you to You are just in time, my friend. Oleg, it is great to see you. Don't worry, there's plenty of people left to kill. Let's head inside and find Angel. I think that was him just running inside. Loving the uh, statue. You're not one of Lorenz's brutes. And you are not one of Kilbane's luchadors. Both true. No, but they are. <laughs> Leave this imposter to me. What? Sorry for wrecking your place, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Pimp slap. And I will take your minigun. Yeah, well, I got a minigun. Like, wow. Nope. Bad, 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 bad touch. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, like you good? We good here? Yeah, well, we are. Ladies and 
Gentlemen, Philippe is dead, and we are at a crossroads. And the question is, who will lead the Syndicate to a new era? Viola and Kiki were Mr. Lorenz's right hands. I had someone else in mind. Excuse me? The Syndicate has to answer for what they did. And this time, we're taking the fight to them. Since we don't know Steel Ford, I brought in some people who do. This is Kinsey, Zemos, and Angel. The barbarians are at the gate! We need a general, not an ambassador! Calm down, Eddie. What did you call me? What would you like us to do, Kilbane? Something! Anything! Before I wonder why I keep you bookends around! Talk to one of these guys. They'll have things for you to do. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. So I do like the um, idea that they kept the luchador culture. That is, you're not supposed to know who's under the mask. They like they took, take that so seriously. So I like how they incorporate that into Kilbane's thing of mentioning his own name is like a do not fucking go there. Good, good stuff. So we got Kinsey's crib, we got Angel's crib, and we got the that in Zemos's pad. And we got some more customization for the gang. And this is where this is a good spot to call. We we took out Loren. We increased our uh influence over the city. I still don't know what those ones are supposed to be. Oh, we didn't do one more trafficking. Oh, well, we'll do that next time. Um, we're almost done with this area. There's like, what? There's only two more gang operations, and it's those two plus the, uh, what's it called? That. But also, next time, we're going to go over here and start in taking all over this. So the next episode is going to be hopefully finishing that, starting over here and increasing our holdings. And then we'll continue from there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. What, what can I get? Ooh, upgrade, yes. I know I said I'm going to end. I just want to... Nah, we'll get that to later. Bonuses. Cash for respect. Fuck it, why not? Um... Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, we'll do all those next time, because we really don't... Ooh, let's... Yeah, let's get rid of the fuck... Give me that. And give me the notoriety for the cops. All right, so yeah. Picking this up next time. We went from 19 to how much? So yeah, we're, we're quarter done, which isn't bad. Overall totally think we made a good amount of progress in the, these past couple episodes and uh yeah see you in the next video bye bye